and I'm doing it for my daughter. I like how uh, I like how specifically you break down comedians. Like you talk about um, amateur comedians. There was one thing you were pointing out that's like very stereotypical of that, which is when they say, uh, as you do. Oh, yeah. That shit. Like you do. As one does. Yeah. It's just like little, little uh, linguistic like word yeah, tracks yeah, yeah. that people. So I'm single. Fall that's into a, that. That's the classic. Type of thing. Oh, but there's one they do where it, there's one that they do where they uh, where they're like, so I was going through the garbage looking for pop tarts to eat as you do. Yeah, but that's like a very common and it's like a it's such an oddly specific combination of words to become so as common as it is that it just the the joke the point is that the specificity of it makes it obvious how derivative all the shit is because they're all just watching each other. Right. Learn one trick. Yeah. L.A. shit. L.A. L.A. Uh, I used to watch. I don't know. You, have you gone to stand-up shops? Stand-up shows? No. I'm such a fucking non, non-watcher, non which Who's, is sad. Yeah. I don't. I haven't, done, I haven't done any stand-up anything ever. I used to go to Venice stand-up a lot. Mm-hmm. Venice Underground. You ever do that room there? No, I haven't. California? A lot of, lot of good uh, people. I think it was like a room. I don't, I don't get it. Like, I'm just a fucking... I feel like I'm a fucking... When I talk about stand-up. Me too. Like, I get television a little bit. Like, oh, the show's bought. I get that. I get the lingo. Books. Wait, you don't get, like, the appeal of it or what? No, no, I just don't get, All like, the, the insider the business. type stuff. Yeah, I, I don't get it either. Like, like did you drive here? Like, I'm totally <laughs> yeah. fucking, like, what? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Wait. How's, how's it work? <laughs> Who books you? <laughs> yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do they pay you at the end of the night? <laughs> when do you get the money? Like, yeah. and I'm, I'm just, like, logistics bother me a lot. So, like, if I, I like, and I understand why my wife and I are married because my wife's, like, fucking half autistic and I love her. I love that about her. But it's always, like, she can't, when she, if she can't figure out something, I just, like, I just get glitchy. Like, how did you get here? Right? Did you Uber here? <laughs> okay, you're staying in a hotel. Got it. You're doing two, three nights at yeah. uh, Providence. All right, got it. I did that. I've done that. I've done stand up there when I was 20. Fucking bombed. Awful. It was terrible. I did an open mic and I fucking just made a fool out of myself yeah. in front of like my no friends. Yeah, that's what happens. You got to be a psycho and just keep bombing for five years. Five more times. And people just keep <clears throat> doing it. Nick's really, Nick's good. He's, you'd be really good. You yeah, do, I've, you seen, I've seen you do really good stuff in front of crowds. I'm a mess. But I know I, saw, I know what you mean when you say you bomb. I'd be, oh, I'd be a bomb. I'd fucking just get in a bad mood. I, yeah. I'd, I'd be getting in a bad mood, and I wouldn't want to talk to anybody. I'd be like, what's up? They'd be like, I don't know, dude. You're the fucking guy. Go. You'd and I'm like, on, now I'm here. You'd be on stage, <laughs> and you'd go, what's up? Yeah, what's good? I don't know. Uh, all right, dude, what do you do? And he's like, ah, oh, pipe fitter. And I'm like, yeah, that fucking job makes a lot of money. <laughs> Pipe fit is actually the highest paid fucking job in the fucking, you know, all the blue collar shit. That's the big one. That's like 75 bucks an hour. You fucking take a lot of pills. Yeah, you do. Yeah, he's lying. Uh, all right, it's my time. Peace. <laughs> yeah, I, don't, I, I can't. I just like. That's I, a good set. That's it. Yeah, that was a good set. Not bad, right? Yeah. All right. I'll go. Yeah, cool. I'll, I'll talk. I like I'll do, I'll do open mics. And, yeah. You know, get back into it, dude. <laughs> do a spot tonight. How will I get there? <laughs> just drive my truck? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, do they have parking? My, it's an F-350, like long bed. It's fucking, it's a pain in the ass to park. Dude. Fuck, they'll probably get pissed. It's diesel, it's loud. That's really funny. I'm the same way about logistics. Like, I need to know. Yeah. I need to know what the hell is going on. Like, I can't just dive into something. I can't go do that. I need to know who, like, what is the, what's the, what do I do? Yeah, waiting around. Deal? Wait. What do, you mean? The, what do you mean? Like the state, this stuff, like stand up, the, the simplest where, logistics possible. Where's the line start? Who's the, who's yeah. the guy that I, who's this guy walking around with lanyards on? Yeah. How long do you sit in the green room? Do for? I need my hand stamp? Is someone gonna come get me? Yeah. How do I know? Yeah, like all that shit. Do you do this? I, you do the same thing twice? You just say the same shit twice. That's Every night, do. dude. Every night. Same thing. Forty minutes, Ed? Yeah, same thing. It's a fucking great. I love it. And I'm, it's fun. Yeah. It's still fun. I got your whole office watching my shit. Yeah. I got your whole my boss all watching it on his fucking headphones. Like, watch this shit. It's fucking funny. I'm gonna go meet this guy. He's like, fuck out of here. I was like, yeah, yeah. Dude, it's funny, huh? He's like, yeah, it's fucking funny. He's a lot less funny in person. And I know that. <laughs> <laughs> no, but like every night, four, tw- twice, and people they filter out. They come in and out. And you do it again. Just do it again. Yeah. So, I mean, you change some things, but yeah, yeah, for for the most part, it's almost the exact same thing. Are you having fun? Yeah, it is. It's genuinely like. You'll say something and the crowd will laugh, and you still get that feeling of like, yeah, mm-hmm. <laughs> like there is that like this is fun thing. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and they pay at the end. The, of the worst night. though is when you're bombing and you're just in fucking autopilot of jokes. You know, 
I like the like, bomb. I like it. This kid lives there. <laughs> <laughs> You're good at it, Sammy. Yeah, but you, you, I've watched you. I've watched your stand-up clips. You mm. bomb like it's a resentful bomb. Like you're doing it at the audience, which is funny. <laughs> I fucking love. But it. when you show up and you're trying to get everyone in the room to like you, yeah. and they're like, "This sucks," and you're just up there like. Uh, you guys ever go too deep in the pussy? You know how black people do it? <laughs> and they're just like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> then you do an act out. An act out is just when you're up there like, this is how I fuck. <laughs> and no one's laughing. It's just like. <clears throat> like you know, just got to keep going. Living in it for yeah. fucking three minutes uh, straight. You can see pe- you can, and you can see people literally just like. <laughs> you'll, you'll make eye contact because you're, you're scanning the room and you'll see yeah, someone yeah, that yeah. doesn't know you're about to look at them that's making a face like yeah you be like fuck what is this and then you look at them like what the fuck is your problem <laughs> that's what I've been doing I've been bucking at ladies that aren't laughing and that makes me very happy like to turn and see a lady that's uh-huh. just going fuck Fuck you back. grimacing at fat <laughs> yeah. ass. Yeah. <laughs> Just fucking come right at him. Because I'm, I'm, I'll be honest, I'm a little intimidated around you guys. I'm a big fan. No, you're not. I am. You intimidated? Yeah. No That's way. Crazy. I'm intimidated. Have you ever seen? I've a been, shit? I've been a fan, dude. I've been watching your shit since, like, when it started. My buddy Burke was in one of your videos. Burke Williams, the bodybuilder video. Yeah. You're friends with Burke Williams. Yeah, I'm very. I hung out with him last week. Burke Williams is the fucking man. He is That's the crazy. funniest dude. I love Burke Williams. Yes, Burke Tell Williams. him we said what's up. I will. Nice. Yeah. I know. <laughs> Did you have that bet? I don't know. What, what do you want to talk about, dude? I'm having a good time. <laughs> I'm just listening, though. I'm wary of talking David too much. Duke. David Duke, yeah. That's uh, fun, right? Having a guy come on and just do lines from your shows? Well, do you want... Can we watch... Um, <laughs> how much money do you make? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I'm just joking. I'm just messing around. You got to tell him how much money what you, you make, How much Sam? money are you guys making yeah. off the podcast? Joey, bleep this? <clears throat> off the pot. Also, ig- ignore it also. <laughs> uh, a month? Yeah. That's awesome. And then we just sold um, $50 of t-shirts. Mm. Hell yeah, bro. And we're doing NFTs. We're going to make a million on that. Yeah? What NFTs are you doing? We're making the craziest NFTs that anyone's ever seen. It's wild. They're fucking awesome. They're do you want to show the NFT? Oh. You'll see. Oh. I'll give you one. I'll Please, send, I'll dude. Send, you one. send one to Rogan. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I will. I would. Have you been on Rogan? I have. How was it? Uh, first time was awkward. Is he a cool guy? He is. He's the fucking man. Oh, cool. Yeah, he's that's the fucking cool. man. He actually is. That's nice. Yeah. For a guy that's that famous, he's very, mm-hmm. very cool. I mean, he's cool for a normal 50-year-old. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you know. He's not cool for a 30-year-old. How did <laughs> if he was 30, I'd be a little like, <laughs> all right, this is weird. This guy's weird. Yeah. Yeah, that's, I saw you on there. Yeah, the first one was, uh, well, I mean, the first one we just sat down and talked about, like, cancel culture and SNL. Does he like your comedy? He does. Mm. That's what everybody seems to talk about with you. I, I didn't want to yeah. talk about that with you. Everybody wants no, to talk about your SNL. I don't, you know. Normally, I don't care, but on that one, I was like, oh, fuck, this is a pretty big audience. Mm-hmm. I'm going to look like a fucking, you know. Got to give them what they want. Yeah, but it's, yeah. What do people think? Do they? What was the feedback? Uh, it was, the first one was fine, but then I went on two more times and just fucked around, mm-hmm. and that was good. That got a good feedback. Okay, cool. And that's helping sell shit. Yeah. And sell tickets and stuff. But the first one, I was like nervous, mm. which is never, you know, that sucks. Mm-hmm. Getting like a red face. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Talking about Saturday Night Live. Like, I like all those guys over there, though. They're pretty cool. <laughs> like, trying to be political about something. Damn. Being yeah. diplomatic about yeah. some fucking, you, you wish you'd <laughs> walk in there with mag- backpacks full of magazines. And you're trying to be nice about it. Like, <laughs> Yeah, I, I, that's the, the, the story. I looked into the SNL because SNL is the fucking, was, is, is, is a fucking toilet. <laughs> it is the worst fucking show ever. And it is the dream of arguably everybody in this room before it got yeah. full toilet. You yeah. know, if I had to look at fucking Leslie Jones and fucking <laughs> Cecily Strong be a fucking maniac, um, so she could have been okay. But I analyzed the show uh, so much. Yeah. And I, you write sketches. A lot. Yeah, yeah. Do you like sketches or do you like stand up a little bit more? Do you? I like I, I like doing sketches. I can't write for shit. My friend John writes them. Okay. And I just show up. Fuck man. He's good at writing. Because you you the the job when you're on SNL, I'm like, man, this they're gonna pull him up on SNL. It's fucking wild. Yeah. I how's this gonna roll? <laughs> <laughs> Turns out pretty short. You know what I mean? About uh, four days. 
We We're, did it, dude. <laughs> <laughs> you there, man. It was so funny, man. Just for having like one day of, because that's how long I knew I was going to be on the show. Yeah. For like one day before it got announced. And I was like, I did it. <laughs> and then the next day, it was like, this piece of shit. Damn. I had to like call people. Damn. Yeah, it sucked. Did you get to uh, meet a lot of the cast? Uh, I know a lot of them now, yeah. Do you, do you pal around with anybody now? Yeah. There's a couple, there's, there's people there that are cool. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. You just won. Yeah, there's Kyle a Mooney's cool. Yeah, I don't know Kyle Mooney at all. Yes, I, I, uh, we got cocked with Nick Rutherford, who's Kyle Mooney's boy, and he's a nice guy. Yeah. At the Adult Swim Upfronts, and I was talking to him about He got kicked off the writer's crew. Yeah. And I was Kyle like, man, did? Nick Rutherford did. Okay. But it was kind of, I was like, yeah, man, I'm the fucking, I work with two guys that are just mad funny, and I'm the fucking friend of my buddies. <laughs> <laughs> and I kind of felt bad because I was basically like, yeah. and that's you too, dude. <laughs> like now you're at Adult Swim making fucking 60 grand a year yeah. with me. And I'm a fucking loser and you're a too, right? Yeah, dude. Fucking you have a <laughs> I'll find some. And then I found it. Yeah, uh, yeah, it, was, yeah it was in fucking uh, the VP's room. Uh, but like he, he was a writer and, he, and he's like the only exposure. That's my dream job is to be like a fucking writer for SNL. And then the show has been such shit for fucking eight years. I was like, oh, man, someone's going to breathe a life of fresh air. But the whole show is just going to go to fucking hell. Yeah. It's still an institution. It can still be revived. No, it can't. It could if there was like some, I mean, hypothetically, if there was some kind of crazy sea change of, of cultural thinking and like personnel. It won't be, but it could be. Yeah, it could be. Any, I guess that's could be funny. to say because anything could happen. It's true. So Not, fuck it. Kate McKinnon dominance is never going to waver, though. They're going to be like, put Kate McKinnon out there a few more times as Ellen, and that's going to work. That's, that's we're going to That sucks. I don't want to say anything. You know, I don't want to get fucking get you in hell. Oh, I don't give a fuck. No. What are they? Yeah. yeah what's There's the no fuck? more I hope water. Kate McKinnon gets <laughs> 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 Yeah, you're right. That dual citizenship with fucking, uh, fucking Lauren <laughs> fucking bothers me, man. Yeah. Why the fuck Bleep is that? he a dual citizen <laughs> in Israel? It's like he's got a fucking. What did Lorne Michaels do to get dual citizenship in Israel? That's fucking, fucking bomb. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. right, that's what I thought we were going to be doing. Oh, you got to believe that. That's, yeah. that's more, that's more right. what I was preparing yeah, for. Yeah, if Michael Che wants to fucking come around me, he better fucking put his boxing gloves on. <laughs> <clears throat> that's all I can fucking say.